Okay, um, so for example, we have the character of Lucifer, uh, which is to do with light. And that is essentially derived from a Latin term. Now the Hebrew go in, in the book of Isaiah, how thou art fallen, O bright one, son of the morning, the morning star, or something like that. Now it's in the original context, it's probably like this. In, in the Near East, certain parts of the world where you look for the sun to rise, the thing that happens before the sun rises is the, the ascent of the morning star or planet Venus or something like that. It, it ascends and it fills the sky with a certain amount of brightness. And you could look at it and think, wow, the sun has risen. But actually that's not the sun because when the real sun rises, the light of the morning star just vanishes entirely and disappears. Now, this is a very common phenomenon, especially in the Near East, where you have these brilliant views of the skies at night and, and, and these, these phenomena. We think that in antiquity, this led to a literary trope in which a upstart deity tries to assume the full glory of the sun. And then the sun comes up and shows its true glory. And it seems that Isaiah taps into this to talk about the arrogance of a heavenly being who tried to usurp God's position, only to have it completely, um, his folly fully exposed. Now, beyond that, any other statement you want to make, any other identification you want to make has to be recognized as secondary interpretation.